Cruise by Mandy. I am on board my first scenic river cruise and I'm going to do a quick comparison of scenic versus Ama Waterways on the top sun deck only because I've been on Ama Waterways three times already. So I'm going to span, uh, spin around right here. I keep getting distracted by all the cool things here in Amsterdam. So over there is Ama Mora, part of Ama Waterways. Ama means love. You can see the type of tables up front on their sun deck and their chairs. And over here, you do have the tables with the umbrellas up, which is very nice here on the shaded day, on the sunny day, to have some shade. But notice these four loungers with ottomans in front of us. So you can sit here and watch as you're going through the locks or whatever happens to be going on. So let's take a stroll down this deck. Amsterdam train station is right over there. River cruises go through here as do ocean cruises and Rotterdam sailed away yesterday. For both of these cruise ships, and of course all of the cruise ships are very similar on the rivers because of the heights of the bridges and locks and lengths. And the, the dock house does fold down, goes down. I haven't found the bikes yet on Scenic. Um, I don't know if they use them in port and don't carry them with. So I'm on a mission to find that out, but Ama does carry their bikes with them and they do have children's bikes. Ama does contract with Disney, um, Adventures by Disney. So um, you do see a lot of that. They do have that pool right there that is outdoors with that bar. And on a day like this, oh, that would be perfect. Um, always look for the bell and the bell here is on the side versus the front. So I gotta figure out why, why is the bell on the side? You always have these lift systems on boats because the gangway is usually stored up here while sailing. This looks down into the atrium area to give fresh light, but it's a little more um, opaque here. Got chests on both sides here. Should we need to be jumping from ship to ship when we are tethered? That's usually where they set up. I often see them testing out the bikes on all my river cruises. Um, you have the loungers here where you can prop your feet up. And over here, you have more of a sunbed so you can lay down. So if you're wanting that, you can do that as well. Again, the canopies here pop down when going through areas such as bridge. If we've got high water and, the, and if it's high water and too close, they'll pop these down. Everything is collapsible up here on the top deck. So if you're looking and saying, why are those like folding chairs like I might have at home? It's because there are times you can't be up here because you'll like hit your head on the bridge going under the bridge. So this is just a quick walkthrough. We've got a track on both sides. I know on Ana they do the digestive walks for the gastro after eating. And so that's kind of nice. And um, I'm interested to see what we have this week on Scenic as a comparison. There are several cruise lines that do the rivers. So when somebody comes to me and says, I want such and such, I'm like, well, have you considered this? They're like, I've never heard of them. So it's great to be able to be on these and test them out. And there's usually a crew area on the aft of each of the ships. So there you go. And as you can see, these are about the same length, same height, same width, because you know what? They are going on the same rivers and have to go through the same locks. So Cruise by Mandy signing off from the sun deck of the beautiful scenic crystal.